بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين سيدنا ونبينا ومولانا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين رب شرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحل الأقدة من لساني أفكو كولي السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته I must first tell you I must first tell you, since the first time that I uttered the words, I am Hamas, and I saw how the Zionists are shaking in their boots when they hear the words Hamas, now I must see that Al-Quds Foundation says we are all Hamas. <laughs> Not only that, our esteemed professor Farid. Oh, what Allah is <laughs> no one in Because you are also Hamas. <laughs> and by the way, Professor Farid and our honorable MC, Sheikh Abdurrahman Alexander, and myself, we are all from Born to Evil. <laughs> <laughs> now you can understand why we are so demaka. <laughs> Everybody, when we see this, we are all Hamas. When we say that we are Hamas, then it means it comes with a certain strength. It comes with a certain support. Of course, we are getting the pressure from the Zionists, but that pressure is worth nothing compared to what our Palestinian brothers and sisters in Gaza, Palestine, Lebanon, Yemen, and everywhere is going through. So we are, we are quite proud to say that we are Hamas. But in this struggle for Palestine, it needs strength. It needs strength, everybody. And I want to remind you of a hadith that I love to quote of the Nabi alayhi salatu wasalam. And the Nabi alayhi salatu wasalam says, Al mu'min al qawi khayrun wa habu ila Allah min al mu'min al daif. Wa fi kullin khayr, ihri salama yan fauk, wa sta'in billah, wa la ta'jaz. فَإِنْ أَصَابَكَ شَيْءٌ فَلَا تَكُلُّ أَنِّي فَعَلْتُ كَذَا وَكَذَا وَلَكِنْ كُلْ قَدَّرَ اللَّهُ وَمَا شَعَ فَعَلَ فَإِنَّ اللَّهُ تَحْتَحُ عَمِلُ الشَّيْطَانِ The hadith reminds you and me all the time that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is more happy and loves the person, the mu'min that is strong and in both of them, they are good because they both mu'mineen. Ihris ala ma yanfauk. Be eager for that which benefits you. To support the oppressed. To support the people of Palestine and Gaza. To support Al-Quds Foundation and what you've seen there and everything that they are busy with. Ihris ala ma yanfauk. Be eager to support for that which will benefit you. It will benefit you in your cover. When you lay there in your cover, you're going to ask, Ya Rabbi, where did all this khair come from? Because you stand with your priest. Wasta'in billah. Seek the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala on your way. There is no way that we will make progress, that we will move this world except with the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And here comes my favorite saying. Don't be weak. Don't be incapable in the sight of the Zionist. And let me use my famous Afrikaans word for all of us. Munipap visi. Because our people, our people know resilience here of Cape Town. 
And I want to connect with what the professor had said about the building that you are in. The place that you are in. Know verily that your forefathers have fought colonialism and racism just so here, right here in this, your fathers, forefathers were in chains on their wrist and on their ankles and Islam was called a Satanist religion. And the Muslims at that time were called Satanist. And like I always say, they must have put their hands up and said, Ya Allah, how is Islam going to survive here? But they were resilient. That was the people that have gone and they have earned by Allah Ta'ala whatever they have earned. But yourself and myself and we in this zaman, in this time, what are we going to achieve? What are we going to tell Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the zaman that we live? When we saw how a baby is pulled from a building while the umbilical cord is still attached to the baby. What are we going to say to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala when a young man is pulled from the building after it has collapsed and the only thing that they can bring out is only flesh and skin. The bones are all been crushed. So therefore, Jamaat al-Muslimin and everybody present, there is no ways that we can sit down with our phones and we say, oh, I don't want to see this. You know, I don't want to know this. I'm so tired of seeing this. You have to see it. You have to live it. You have to feel the pain. You have to feel upset. And you have to do something about it. And you have to do something about it. If you are asking, where is all the gains? I've listed the gains for you. That has been happening now since 7 October. So what was the gains that was achieved if we didn't take note? The Israeli economy is down in the doldrums. Migration from Palestine, from Israel. Have you seen the Ben-Gurion airport? It's filled with migration. They're running. There is desertion from the army. There is no more tourism. There is a global community that has now become what? The global community has become Palestinian. The global community has become Palestinian, everybody. The illegitimate, faulty Zionist state of Israel has lost 